The craziest thing that happened at Disney, there was two zebras having sex outside of Kevin's window. That was the craziest sucking shit at Disney. <laughs> he videotaped it and everything. He sent it to our group in the morning. He sent it to Garrett and he said, thinking of you, Garrett. I don't know, I don't know. That's literally the craziest shit that happened. Jeez. Guys, Garrett was wearing compression socks, okay? Don't make fun of my baby. He, we went to the doctor and his veins that pushed blood all the way back up his legs don't work very well. He has long ass legs. So his legs get really, really, really swollen when There's he walks a lot or when he goes on airplanes. So yeah, he has to wear compression socks. Go. And it's not the easiest to find compression socks that are white. Okay, I bought him black compression socks. I bought them. Okay. <laughs> it wouldn't have been so hot over there if Romy showed up spitting everywhere. It was a lot of fun. No dystopian. I didn't see that. Dystopian. I didn't see that. Hi, Tanny. How are you? Yeah, the vlog should be good, guys. Should be good. Guys, my head is killing me right now. Yeah, Garrett's the best. It was for Garrett's birthday. I actually planned this months ago because he wanted to hang out with CG for his birthday. And I said, okay, let me plan this. And we were supposed to go to Jamaica originally, but then Garrett surprised me with a Jamaica trip. So I was like, okay, I can't surprise Garrett with a Jamaica trip now. Like, let's go to a different country. So <laughs> we all booked a trip Man, to that's what I hate uh, Turks and Caicos. But then with traveling, it didn't work for some of us. So then we all changed our plans and got refunds and then booked our trip to Disney. Yeah, Disney and I'm really glad that bad. like it all worked out in the end and we all got to hang out and just spend time together. Honestly, it's like, it is a family. What, like, uh, what did you say? It's not like yeah, come on. surface level shit, you know? Like Hats? we all like, everyone what truly loves say? each other, cares about one another. Um. You know what I mean? Seven. Like, actually Why feels you like. Just run over the box and blow it up. There's no judgment. You're just with the people you love. <laughs> like, you don't need to like. I don't know how to explain. It. It's just like hanging with your family. That felt. It was really fun. And although, obviously, I'm newer into this family. Garen and I've been dating for like nine months almost, but it's nice. Everyone treats me like family too, and I really appreciate it a lot. It was a. It was a really fun time. We definitely want to do more trips like this. We want to internationally travel together and like be more fun like that. Oh, <laughs> you want to make it's your own lightsaber, cool? Let's do it. Yeah, it is natural. And it's funny because that picture with everyone um, laughing, it actually was us genuinely laughing because the girl uh, taking a photo was like, everyone pretend to laugh. And then we all started laughing because we thought that was so like cringe. And then like, it just ended up being a really good photo. <laughs> it was just so funny. Yeah, the city must have been so dead when CB and CG weren't live. Except like Rami and Randy and them. How different were they in person? Who? CG? I mean, Garrett and... Garrett and I met them for the first time a few months ago. Met Carlo, his May wife, the and then Kevin and his girl. Um, that was my first time meeting Taco. Taco's the sweetest. Hutch is so sweet. That was my first time meeting Hutch. Garrett already have, like met all of them. Um, it was, yeah, it was literally the same. <laughs> it was pretty much the same. Kevin's super, super laid back and chill. Taco's laid back and chill. Taco's so funny. Taco's a scaredy cat. We trolled him the entire trip, guys. Like we went, I was telling the story earlier, but we went in the safari track. Um, and you get on like a truck and you go around and see animals. And we kept telling him like, all the animals are fake. It's for the little kids, don't worry. And then like, we started going on it. And we were like, actually they're real. Like the alligators are gonna eat you, Taco. Like, yeah, right, these are fake. You guys are liars. Like he actually believed the animals were fake. It was the funniest thing. And then anytime we went on the roller coasters, we would tell him like there's an insane drop and he'd be so scared, but then there was no drop. <laughs> it was so fun trolling Taco the entire time. Oh man, it was my dance. Uh, it was great. Did that answer his phone? Uh-oh. It was really oh, great. Sheesh. He hung up and he had